day in Arvis in the beginning is the first time that the public will ever see rare pictures from the beginnings of her career. Nobody could do this exhibition but the Metropolitan Museum. We have her archive, her papers, and hundreds of her photographs. We're looking at 1956 to 1962, made primarily in New York City, from Times Square to Coney Island to the Lower East Side. The same terrain that so many other artists of the era covered offered this artist a new way of understanding who we are and who we might be. You feel the authentic quality of each of the individuals. All of these prints were made by the artist. They're small, they're intimate. She loved the way the light wrapped around figures. There's a poetics of the light. There's a kind of warm embrace of it. She seems to be able to separate the individual from the society. That is the power of a great Dianarvis picture. That incessant need to know and to record and to follow her own eyes to wherever it took her is defining of her career. I think people will see that the artist had explored all the same issues, all the same sort of poetics, and the intensity of experience that you know from a Dianarvis photograph was in play at the very beginning.